Well, we've been talking about aftershocks, and if you are worried about being on, say, a BART train when an aftershock hits, BART wants you to know that it has an earthquake early alert system in place. And as our tech reporter Gabe Slate reports, the quake, the Napa quake, was a good test for that system. This is the 10 second alert that BART received in their main control room Sunday morning when the Napa quake started. Earthquake, light, shaking expected in three seconds. So this was great. This was a great success for us. The system accurately detected the earthquake. It assessed the size of the earthquake and it pushed out a warning to our group of test users. The system was created with help from the University of California, Berkeley and ShakeAlert, a multi-agency group pushing for a statewide earthquake alert system. What, by partnering with Cal and being able to get that early warning, it provides us that extra lead time to allow us to be able to slow those trains down, prevent the injuries, prevent the derailments, keep our system whole and stay operational in a very critical post-earthquake time. BART had no trains running when the Napa quake hit, but if they had, the early alert system would have automatically stopped or slowed down trains that were in danger of possible derailment. And train operators would have been immediately notified so they could be prepared for further action. They get this warning and they can now slow and stop the trains, thereby potentially reducing the impacts of future earthquakes. Right, so one other thing I wanted to tell you about that I thought was interesting that we learned at this BART press conference today was they were talking about all the retrofitting they've done the last few years on the whole BART system. And uh, they were talking about the safest place to be on a BART train during an earthquake if you happen to be actually riding a train. And I was really surprised to find out yeah. that they said it's the Transbay tube. You're kidding. I know, I isn't that crazy? So it's the that. tunnel, you know, under the water, through the bay. You would think that's the scariest place. Yeah. So we're like, really? How is that? And they said, well, we put so much money and time into the retrofitting of the tube. It's actually the strongest wow. place to be when there's a big shake. So who knew? So I think that's really good news for East Bay commuters. And I just wanted to pass that along. That's the place to be in All the right. tube. All right, our tech reporter. Thanks, Gabe.